gonna videotape the dog first before we begin because I am in shock and I was warned. Oh, how I was warned. But I didn't listen. You tried to warn me. Okay, on that note, let's begin the review. Okay. <laughs> So, season finale, let's begin with the first one. I know that that wasn't the most shocking of them, but, you know, we gotta kinda, like, you know, get the other one done, one and done, and then, you know, we can talk about that other one. <laughs> so, what did you think of the first part of the season finale? Are you pretending that's alcohol or something? Like, nope. you need a swig? <laughs> Nope. Okay. Just a dry throat. <laughs> um, <laughs> Just well, a dry Dean got to finally use the uh, grenade, grenade launcher. launcher. <laughs> that was the best use of a grenade launcher yeah. ever. That was awesome. Um, and ouched himself a little bit. Yes, yes. He injured his leg, but... That was a nasty wound. That is very true. But despite his bum leg, he kicked ass. It was so awesome. Got his mama back. He did. Okay, so let's talk about that scene because I was a crying mess and you were slapping me and trying to get me under control. And I was like, I was not that slapping you. <laughs> I was holding your hand. You were. Okay, all right. I won't tell everyone you slapped me. Don't give me a bad rep. <laughs> We, re we do reviews for a living. We already have a bad rep. They've seen what we do. So, um, let's talk about that scene. Um, that was so well performed by Jensen. <laughs> Extremely powerful. Mm -hmm. I thought that at the moment when he, he went into the dream and he was gonna, you know, watch her, I thought it was a memory. And it was a memory, but it was her memory. And then I thought he was gonna say, I love you. And the minute he said, I hate you, my heart leaped in my throat. I was like, ah! <laughs> no. And then his speech and how it woke her up and it helped her realize, you know, she stop can't. ignoring me. <laughs> she can't look at the, she can't keep her mind occupied on what was. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, so that was so well done, I have to say. I thought, I thought that that scene was amazing. And it actually made me love Mary even more because I got to kind of see the Mary that I was used to from the seasons before. And then I got to kind of see the two collide. And that was really needed for me to understand where Mary's coming from and all this. And I love that, you know, she and Dean hugged. I love that she and Sam hugged. I love that Sam and Dean finally hugged in this season. They hugged twice. They gave, they made a Mary sandwich. A Mary, that's what I thought. I said, Mary sandwich. <laughs> it's like, I can't breathe. Die. <laughs> <laughs> how awful would that be if that's how Mary died? In oh, God. So now I have Mary sandwich. <laughs> no. Um, but one of the things that I hate I that I was happy about was a certain someone's death. Cash. Cash? Yeah. Oh, Cash's death was okay. I wanted Dean to be the one to kill him, but I felt, I'm... I felt pretty satisfied. I am okay, yes. Dean got to actually fight he him. got to but fight Mary him. Mary got to get the last blow. Well, you said you said last, last week that you wanted Mary to be the one to kill him. And that you said, well, maybe Dean can fight him. And I said, no, that's not good enough. But it was. Because even with a bum leg, he took that plaque of wood and just smacked him around it was awesome mm -hmm. he was he was awesome and he probably would have won if catch hadn't you know cheated with the gun but yes True. mary killed catch but i was talking more about tony because oh my gosh i oh. wanted tony dead uh, i hated oh. that woman getting your throat, throat slit by your own the the company you trusted yeah by the man who might have followed your son who is now an orphan oh. look i get it she pulled the child card with the dean and was all like, you know, let me see my son again. But man, you are an awful person. 
And I'm, I just don't, I didn't feel that bad for her. I was actually happy that she died. And catch two. And honestly, I didn't care that much that Walter Roy died. I don't even know who's who. <laughs> um, uh, I did like the raid. I was scared was for Jody there. I know, I know you were scared for Jody. Yeah. I mean, she's 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 basically team mom. She's amazing. I love Jody. She's just she gives she gives just this comfort to Sam and Dean that they don't notice. they don't get a lot. And that's and, really cool. Yeah. And you know, I love Alex. Um, look, don't get me wrong, Claire. She's a teenager. But she's just got some issues that kind of irk me. And the whole wanting to be a hunter and still not being able to really take care of herself is just kind of <laughs> troublesome. I, I like rescues, but not when a person is, like, so confident they won't take advice. Which is what I loved about Eileen, is that Eileen was willing to work with people and she was willing to train and learn, you know, the, the tactics. Alex just wanted to get away from that life. And so I love that she's going to nursing school and just starting her own, you know, world and just wanting to be a part of it. But still going to visit Jody and patching up Dean's leg and going to stay with Donna. That's just, that's so awesome. I love Alex. I hope to see a little bit more of Alex and um, Jody and Donna. And, just and keep them on the sidelines. They don't need to be hunters. Keep them on the sidelines. Yes, yes. Speaking of being kept on the sidelines... Told you I was gonna talk about it in the review. I told you. I warned you. <laughs> oh god. A tiny mini rant. I promise. That's it. They called Garth. That's awesome. Garth and Bess are okay. I'm so glad. Now, why can they not take five seconds out of the script to put in? Oh, we should check on Kate. <laughs> She's all alone out there in the woods. Or in an apartment in New York City. I don't know how I she gets the would, money. I doubt she would uh, want to go anywhere near a city. I, I don't know I, what I imagine she's she'd doing. find some uh, little retreat kind of place and just do yoga. Hey, that's great. You know what? Let's show that! <laughs> I her again. <laughs> oh my god. episode where they're like oh Kate died oh no she died at least just mention her name even if she dies I'm okay with it like because at least she's acknowledged just like <laughs> stop pretending like she didn't exist please they talked all about her in season 8 they mentioned her in season 10 she had an episode in season 10 what name what time <laughs> okay that rant is done <clears throat> Glad Garth and Bess are okay. One minute and one and eleven seconds. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> timed the rant. <laughs> okay. So, um, what? What? Okay. So, uh, basically, the the episode starts with them stuck inside of the bunker, and they're trying the different ways to get out. And uh, <laughs> goggles. <laughs> <laughs> um, Dean and Sam have a really sweet moment where Sam is just blaming himself because that's what Sam and Dean do. They blame themselves for the world. They're like a Catra from Gundam Wing. They're the reason there's no air in outer space. <laughs> <laughs> I love them so much. They care so much about people and they're always taking the weight of the world on their shoulders. And... Speaking of something like that, I need to show you something after the review. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I, I'm sorry, I got lost in thought there. Sounds um, painful. It is painful, especially with where my mind just went. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. Oh, my God, you killed I'm me, Jan. I'm sorry. Okay, so... I did like the raid. The raid was awesome. Let's talk about the raid. So they, they rallied a bunch of hunters together, and... Um, they uh, they put it all together, and Dean stayed behind because he wants to get his mama back. And he so busted his leg up. He busted his leg up, so he had to... Must have um, been hurting if he... Uh, my gosh, yeah, he doesn't even... He can't even go with them. Like, he's been in worse for wear, and he still kicks butt. So for him to be in that much pain, that he needs to stay behind. But I think he mainly wanted to stay behind for his mama. True. 
Um, so he's got Tony handcuffed. I love how quickly he handcuffed her before he went to sleep. That was hilarious. Like, shoom! <laughs> that was great. Um, but put her to sleep, and she is uh, a sleepins. He's a sleepins, and they go into that dream world, and then they wake up. Or catch and plugs Dean, and um, Tony dead. Tony yeah, got her throat Cash slash. Lit her throat. He is a jerk. That's too bad. Well, it's okay. It's not I that bad. I didn't feel bad for Tony, but I would feel bad for her son. Yeah, I feel bad Probably for her didn't son. didn't even know about it. Although, honestly, if I that's wonder if he has a reputation. Her mo his mother has it. He should be put up for social services, anyways. I wonder if he has a if he has a father. Well, I think Catch is the father. That was the theory, anyway. Mm, I, I didn't know. know that. I don't know that that child should have been taken out of the home years ago after finding out the contract that his his mother his mother was awful and she she allowed herself to get into that and enjoy it too much. So I liked the uh, that. That they managed to kill the director. Yes, the... the raid. Let's talk about the raid. Uh, so we have all the hunters rally together. They go to uh, the the warehouse where the um, middle letters are. Some of the hunters get killed. One of them is Walter Roy. I don't remember which one. I don't care. One of them died so good. And um, Jerry dies. I'm sad about Jerry. Um... Kayla burped, and uh, they, they get to the director. The director tries to convince them to work together because Lucifer is out. And you see Sam, he's... Mm, that's a whole can of worms we'll talk about in a second. Yeah, so we'll get to him in a minute. So um, they're talking about it, they're discussing it, and Sam, in the most badass way ever, looks up and says, Pass. And then shoots the laptop. You bastard. Yes. And then Jody <laughs> shoots Hess. Right in the temple, too. Woo! Right here. You bet your sweet ass. That was actually is. awesome. That was epic. I love Jody. He is awesome. Um, I have to agree with the people on Tumblr. Sam Winchester for Hunter President 2017, definitely. Or 2018. I don't know. He's awesome. He's a great leader. He has potential to be an amazing leader. And... Dean is, uh, he, he has the potential to be an awesome leader, too, because he's practically, you know, uh, raised Sam, and, uh, you know, John did the best he could, but he, you know, had, he had to, you know, <laughs> he went through a lot, so, you know, he, he struggled, but he loved him, and he gave his life for Dean, and, um, you know, uh, Mary, you know, when she, she wanted to give up that life, but you just can't, and, um, she ended up getting killed, which was sad. But they talked about the deal with Azazel, which happened back in season four. Um, Azazel went into her dad's dead body and broke John's neck and made a deal with her that if she let him come to her place in 10 years or something years then um he just wanted to pick something up is what he said then he would save john and she agreed to it and that was to come and grab sam and that deal ends up getting mentioned again in the second half which is really cool and i kind of like how they did that mm -hmm. but uh what, what are we missing here i feel like we're missing something are we missing anything about that Hmm. One. I think that's pretty much it for that that um mm -hmm. half of the show. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make these each fifteen minutes so that we don't risk it with YouTube. So as soon as this makes the fifteen mile marker, I'll turn it off and we'll go to part two. And we'll talk about that the next half. And try not to cry. I cried a lot in this one, but that was mostly tears of hope. The other one was tears of shock. And we'll talk about that in a minute. Last thoughts before the, it hits 15 minutes of this half. Mm. Just enjoyed it, the episode a lot. I'm very glad. I did too. It was awesome. 
Was Dean nice got to be badass. That, uh, Sam the, got to the lead. British Men of Letters got their asses handed to them. Heck yeah. All right, going on to part two. Love y'all. <laughs>